My name is Nardis and I'm from South Africa. I've been living in China for two and a half years now. I'm an English teacher and in my spare time I also love to take photos, uh, especially around the city of Hangzhou. I'm not sure exactly how many photos I've taken of the city yet, but I try to take photos every week and during, during the time I've been here I've been taking photos almost every weekend. Um, I think maybe I've taken more than 2,000 photos in Hangzhou, if not more, but uh, not all of them were good. Um, good photos are definitely much harder to take, but there are many beautiful, beautiful places to see in Hangzhou to take photos of. So I hope that I can continue to take more photos, especially around the time of the Asian Games with all the different changes going on in the city. Since I came to China, there has been a lot of changes going on. And I think uh, in Hangzhou itself, there has been a tremendous amount of change. Uh, this ranges from the infrastructure and also technology around the city. Um, but while there are changes, there are also many uh, uh, parts of the city that has been protected from change that uh, preserve the cultural heritage of the, the city. And um, during this time of the year, uh, as we get closer to the Asian Games, I can see a lot of construction going on. There has been a lot of new venues for the Asian Games that has been constructed in the Shaoshan area where I live. Um, on, from my apartment, I could see a lot of buildings being built. Uh, the area where I live is very close to the Asian Games and we are fortunate enough to have a running track next to the river. I could use this track every day if I want to practice my running and it's very nice to see, see other people also using it on a daily basis. Um, I think that the, the people of Hangzhou is trying to live a very healthy lifestyle and having the Asian Games here will definitely encourage people to also live more actively and a more healthy lifestyle.